Ah, die Wally die rot. Ich will Wally. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What are you doing? Six don't like candles, and also, that's not what that shower means. Ah, not you again. That's right, it's me. And like I said, we don't like candles. Who told you that? Said everyone. So what's your point? My point is, it's ritualistic, and we don't believe in rituals. Come with me. Let me explain to you. To learn the sixth story about Diwali, Deep Mala, Bandi Chod, whatever name you want to give to it, check out these two videos. So what is the answer? Can a sick light a candle on this day? Well, you have to watch the end of this video to find out. So you should have seen both the videos now. Learn the history of when Guru Hargobind Sahib left the city of Amritsar Sahib when they were imprisoned, and all the history of what happened. When Guru Sahib finally returned home to city of Amritsar Sahib, the six in that celebration they lit many rows of candles to welcome Guru Sahib back, known as Deep Mala or Deep Avali. Now this history is referenced by both Sandeep and Guru Bachchan Singh Ji in their katha, but also by Kaan Singh Nabba writes about this as well in their Mahan Kosh. This became an annual celebration where Sikhs would come together known as a Jodh Mela. But what happened many years later, when there's a lot of tyranny and the Sikhs were living in the jungles, there was a price on their head. Bhai Mani Singh Ji tried to revitalize this, bring this alive again by having this Jodh Mela in Sidi Amrita set aside. When Bhai Mani Singh Ji found out that the governor had allowed this to happen only to let all the Sikhs back in and then to try and execute all of them, Bhai Mani Singh Ji cancelled that Jodh Mela this celebration during the time of Diwali and then for that reason Pai Mani Singh Ji attained Shahidi. And this carried on for many many years later on where finally the Jodh Mela was revitalized and even today in city of Haramandar Sahib and across the world many Guru Sikhs light candles in memory and in celebration of that time when Guru Sahib Ji came back to city of Amritsar Sahib and we can go even further with that which we'll explain later on in this video. Hmm, that makes sense. But surely there should be more to Diwali then just lighting a candle, right? But let's go back to the start of the video to find out more. Ah, Diwali di raat, Eve Bali hai. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What are you doing? That's not what that Shabad means. If you look at the Shabad by Pai Gurudashti, they speak to us about different things in our life that give us pleasure. But it's all temporary. So the first thing is the night of Diwali. We light a candle, it looks really beautiful, but by the end of the night or the next morning, that light has been extinguished. Or they talk about the sky. At night time, we see the beautiful stars when there's no clouds, right? And they say to us, Tare Jat Sanata Ambara Pal, you know? There is so many different types of stars and it looks so beautiful. But when the sun comes out, it's gone. So it's temporary again. And they may speak about a garden filled with flowers and how the flowers look so beautiful. But then, you know, after a while, it loses its scent, it loses its beauty. So what they're trying to say to us is that a lot of these things are temporary. The bliss is temporary. But what is forever? They say, at the end of the Shabbat, Gurumukha Sukha Faladata Sabada Samal Yuna. That Gurumukh, the one who always faces that Guru every single day, that person is always in Sukh. Sukha Faladata. They gain the true gift of pleasure. How? By absorbing themselves in the Shabbat. Sabada Samal Yuna. Bhai Gurudash has made it clear to us that a lot of these things are temporary but the pleasure we gain from the Guru's Bani that is eternal, that is forever. And Guru Nadaji goes through this in much more detail. If you look at this idea of a diva, there's nothing wrong with lighting a physical diva. It gives us suk, it gives us pleasure in that moment. But they say, diva mera ekana. They say, take the Guru's name and make it the diva that sits inside our heart. But the Guru is saying to us, take all that pain, take all those challenges and use that to keep this fire alight all the time. And then they say to us, which means that that light that has been lit by Gurbani, by Nam, when we meditate, when we keep remembering the Guru every single day, we keep in that light going and it never goes out. But at the same time, what is the fuel? It's the duk. And all that duk has been burnt away, it's been taken away every time we keep that Nam, that candle going inside us. Then we escape death, and death can, cannot come near us when that happens. So there you go, a short snappy video about Diwali, Deep Mala, Bandi Chod, whatever you want to call it. So in recap, we first spoke about Guru Har Gobind Sahib coming back to city Amritsar Sahib, and in that celebration, 
all the Guru Sikhs lighting candles for Guru Har Gobind Sahib Ji Maharaj. We then spoke about how Pai Mani Sikh Ji tried to revitalize this, bring this back to life, and they gave Shahidi for this. And the present day, we still do this. We then spoke about Pai Gurdasi Shabad, when it spoke about a lot of things being temporary. So this Shabad is not about Diwali, only the first line is, and Pai Gurudash is telling us that these things give us temporary sukh, temporary pleasure. But where we're going to get full pleasure for the rest of our lives is through Gurbani, through the Shabad. And then that was supported by the third point, which is Guru Nandaji telling us, Diva Mera Ek Naam, Dukh Vich Paya Tel. If we're going to light a candle, a candle will never be burnt out. That is the candle of Naam that we should light inside. So a question for you guys is, will you be lighting a candle this Diwali, this Deep Mala? And I can light that candle inside as well of Nam. So we hope you enjoyed this video. Please see all the mistakes we made. Make sure you comment in the comment section and let us know what you want us to cover next in the next videos. And we'll see you guys soon. Vai Guruji ka Khalsa, Vai Guruji ki Fateh. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Please donate and help spread Guruji's message. Link is in the description below. Vai Guruji ka Khalsa, Vai Guruji ki Fateh. I'm